Good evening and welcome to Compline for the ninth Sunday after Trinity on behalf of St Mary's Church Peterborough with Stuart and Elizabeth. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Alleluia. O Christ, you are the light and day, which drives away the night, the ever-shining Son of God, and pledge your future light. As now the evening shadows fall, please grant us, Lord, we pray, a quiet night to rest in you until the break of day. Remember us, poor mortal ones, we humbly ask, O Lord, and may your presence in our souls be now our great reward. Now we have Psalm 4. Answer me when I call, O God of my righteousness. You set me at liberty when I was in trouble. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. How long will you nobles dishonour my glory? How long will you love vain things and seek after falsehood? But know that the Lord has shown me his marvellous kindness. When I call upon the Lord, he will hear me. Stand in awe and sin not. Commune with your own heart upon your bed and be still. Offer the sacrifices of righteousness and put your trust in the Lord. There are many that say, who will show us any good? Lord, lift up the light of your countenance upon us. You have put gladness in my heart. More than when their corn and wine and oil increase. In peace I will lie down and sleep. For it is you, Lord, only who make me dwell in safety. And Psalm 86. Incline your ear, O Lord, and answer me. For I am poor and in misery. Preserve my soul, for I am faithful. Save your servant, for I put my trust in you. Be merciful to me, O Lord, for you are my God. I call upon you all the day long. Gladden the soul of your servant. For to you, O Lord, I lift up my soul. For you, Lord, are good and forgiving. Abounding in steadfast love to all who call upon you. Give ear, O Lord, to my prayer and listen to the voice of my supplication. In the day of my distress I will call upon you, for you will answer me. Among the gods there is none like you, O Lord, nor any works like yours. All nations you have made shall come and worship you, O Lord, and shall glorify your name. For you are great and do wonderful things, You alone are God. Teach me your way, O Lord, and I will walk in your truth. Knit my heart to you, that I may fear your name. I will thank you, O Lord my God, with all my heart. And glorify your name for evermore. For great is your steadfast love towards me. For you have delivered my soul from the depths of the grave. O God, the proud rise up against me, and a ruthless horde seek after my life. They have not set you before their eyes. But you, Lord, are gracious and full of compassion. 
slow to anger and full of kindness and truth. Turn to me and have mercy upon me. Give your strength to your servant and save the child of your handmaid. Show me a token of your favour that those who hate me and may see it and be ashamed. Because you, O Lord, have helped and comforted me. Psalm 134 Come, bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord. You that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary. And bless the Lord. The Lord who made heaven and earth give you blessing out of Zion. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be forever. Amen. Reading from Isaiah 30, verse 15. Thus said the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, in returning and rest you shall be saved in quietness and in trust shall be your strength. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation. Which you have prepared in the sight of every people. A light to reveal you to the nations. And the glory of your people Israel. Glory, glory to, to the, the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Spirit as it was in the beginning, beginning is now and shall be forever. forever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. We pray to the Lord. In faith we pray. We pray to you, our God, that the rest of this week may be holy, peaceful and full of your presence. In faith we pray. We pray to you, our God, that the work we have done and the people we have met this week may bring us closer to you. In faith we pray. We, we pray, pray to, to you, our God, that we may hear and respond to your call to peace and justice. In faith we pray. We, we pray, pray to you, you, our God, that you will sustain the faith and hope of those who are lonely, oppressed and anxious. In faith we pray. We, we pray, pray to, to you, you, our God, that you will strengthen us in your service. Fill our hearts with longing for your kingdom. In faith we pray. We pray to you, our God, God of mercy. You know us and love us and hear our prayer. Keep us in the eternal fellowship of Jesus Christ, our Saviour. Amen. And the collect for the ninth Sunday after Trinity. Almighty God, who sent your Holy Spirit to be the life and light of your church, open our hearts to the riches of your grace, that we may bring forth the fruit of the Spirit in love and joy and peace, 
through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the silent hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the chances and changes of this fleeting world may rest upon your eternal changelessness, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us and guard us in peace, and may your blessing be always upon us. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. And as our Saviour taught us, so we pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus. For the night is at hand, and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. Amen.